live tissue that's feeding this branch, you can see it's kind of swelling up through here, this will start to die over time. What I'm not going to do today is kill this off and strip it all the way down here because that might kill this branch as well. So what we're going to do is strip all the bark off of just the end here and I'm going to put just a very small little wedge of dead wood right at the base here. And then over the, the course of next year and the, the following two or three years, this will start to die naturally back through here. And as that happens, whoever wins this tree in the raffle today, uh, they can start working that back and exposing that dead wood uh, as it starts to naturally appear further down the trunk. All right. So, now it looks like a skinned chicken. All right. <laughs> Only admit it's okay. All right. Okay. So you changed the uh, front. Yeah, so now that we've eliminated all of that growth on the tree, if you look at the tree from this side now, once we turn this into a deadwood feature here, we can pull this back around towards the rear and use the foliage in this area here to create a nice compact tree. Uh, so I think this is actually going to make a better front for this tree. So that's 